Hello, in this video we'll demonstrate how to create zone swim model in order to be used for the airflow requirements calculation. First of all, if we come to the building function here, we can come to the tab airflow requirements, okay? Without any zones, the this dialog will display the building. So, if you would like to, to perform a airflow requirements calculation, it would be assigned for the complete building model, all right? But it's not the case here, so cancel. And I would like first to assign a building zone. To insert any type of zone, we must activate the working mode called building model. And in the architecture toolbox, we have the function zones and the building zones. First, I will show these building zones. So to create a new zone, we click here in the new zone button and we assign a name. Let's assume that now I would like to create a zone for this complete level. So I would like to make a flow requirements calculation for the complete ground floor. So I will type the name of the zone as ground floor. Okay. And we see that the assigned pen color for this zone is red. Now I will select this zone and I will click on the button add or remove rooms to add the room. So I'll click inside each room to assign them to the zone. Now I press enter and coming back to the building zones dialog, we see here the list of all rooms that has been assigned, that have been assigned to, to this zone. All right. So that's done. I will click close. Now we can visualize the rooms that belong to each zone. So to do so, we come to the menu view and then we come to solid few zones. And in this case, because we are talking about the building zones, I will select this option and we see a solid few color with the assigned pen color of the zone for each room that has been assigned for, for, the, for the zone. All right. Now, if we come to building and then see in the tab airflow requirements, instead of the building that we saw previously, now we see the assigned uh, zone that we created the ground floor. Okay. Okay, so now let's assume a different workflow because I would like to use this zone for other type of things like for to create parts list and sort by zones or uh, for heat load calculation, but not for the airflow requirements anymore. So I need this zone, but will not be used for the ventilation discipline. So what I will do, I will come to the function zones and I will create another zone and I will type like this name of the zone is supply. Okay. And in a column type, instead of occupancy, I will set as ventilation. Okay. And I will change the pen color because it's about supply and we have by default the blue color for supply. So this will be supply and blue. Okay. So select this zone, click add, and I'll click on the rooms that will belong for the supply zone. Press enter and I will create a new one, a new zone called extract toilet okay assign to ventilation and click on these two toilets below okay now that's clear here we see here the the rooms for for the extract toilet and here if i click on supply we see here the rooms that belong to this zone all right now click close if we come to menu view I will now activate the solid fuel zones for ventilation zones and I don't need the, the, the building zone anymore. So I will deactivate this color. All right. If we come back to airflow requirements, instead of the building zone, we now see and we have the act activated for the calculation, the ventilation zones.